Roadsters, we're back with part two of how do plants drink water. So the last video I told you I used water, a clear glass, celery, and food coloring to try and find out how do plants drink water. So I let this sit almost all day and I came back and now I'm going to see how does my celery look now. Well, here it is. It's in the water. I'm taking it out the water. And I don't know if you can see it, but it's very red. All in here. And so now this time I have a knife. If you use this at home, ask your mom or dad if you're too young to cut. Don't just start grabbing knives out the cabinet or out the drawers. So I'm going to cut the bottom of my celery. Can you see? Right here you see these holes. This is where how the water travels all the way through into the veins of the leaves. So first I put the water in here and now the, the celery drank all of the water. This is how plants drink. They use their roots and the water goes into the roots and then it travels up towards the stem and here's the stem and it goes into the leaves I hope you can see this but my leaves are all red on the edges that's because there are veins here if you can look see here these veins have help carry water and food towards the plant so it can help it grow I don't know if you can see, but it's red right there. Let's see. See it? Let's see this one. So, that's how plants drink water. They, the wa they take it through the roots. The root carries it through the stem, and it takes it to the leaves. And inside the leaves, there are these tiny veins. And we have veins, too, that carry our blood and has blood in it. But here they use water to carry um, to the different leaves. So Roadsters, I hope you try it at home. It's a very simple science experiment, science investigation. Until next time, take care.